A recent report showing 82% of those looking for a new career after 45 were successful. Here with strategies on how to do this is the author of four books on finding a job and the online job search program, thejobsearchsolution.com, my favorite, Tony Bashara. Good to see you, Tony. Let's start with why people opt to do this. Why do people opt to choose another career? Well, they find out that climbing the corporate ladder wasn't as much fun as they thought it was. A lot of times their jobs just plain went away. Right. And they find out that they've got a lot of intrinsic value in them that they can give to a lot of people. They then go to work not so much for the money or the corporation as they do for the intrinsic value of the job itself. They're a lot more comfortable with themselves, with making mistakes. Oftentimes, they've already raised families, so they don't have a lot of the economic pressure, and they're just better at doing what they do because they're more relaxed and All more right. comfortable with You're it. You're making it sound easy, my friend, and I know it's not. Tell me about the challenges. Because, look, I mean, just figuring out what the career should be in the first place is no easy thing. You know, I, like I've said before, it's like bench pressing 500 pounds. It's simple, but it's hard. <laughs> okay? So what, what you got to do is you got to be you got to be realistic about what you can look for. The further away you get from the kinds of things you've done before, the harder it's going to be. But for instance, if you're an accountant in the banking industry, it's not too hard to become an accountant in the uh, in nonprofit or things like that. Uh, get ready for a long haul and get real inspired by it. Read a lot of inspirational stuff. I recommend knowing yourself. I recommend going to the Johnson O'Connor Foundation. It's a foundation, not for profit, that measures your aptitudes and your skills and it tells you the kinds of things that you could be doing. Forget trying to apply for a job online with a major corporation. You're not going to find this is it that critical. way. This is critical. I want to yeah. slow you down here because you just rat a tat tat okay. that advice and I think people miss out on things. Folks are always sending out resumes to some uh, voiceless anonymous email and nobody ever reads this stuff it's got to be especially, personal contact right yeah especially if you're changing industries people are comparing your resume with 180 other resumes of people that are doing what they want in the job they want and that's not going to work you're going to mm -hmm. have to do it personally you're going to have to go into businesses you're going to have to make lots of personal contacts where you show up volunteer uh, do pro Good bono idea. work to find out if you'd be interested in something and then you've got a network like crazy forget sending resumes and realize that you're probably going to have to go to work for a lot less money than well, you worked for before though, we have a full screen here that says that not everybody's unhappy with a the salary they get in a second career let me show you right. some numbers here 18 percent say that we're paid the same 50% say their salary rose, 31% said they had a lower sal salary. So it is possible to find something that makes you happy and also pays you money. Tony, we're going to have to leave it there. So good to see you. Thanks for coming on the show. Always a pleasure. Thank you. And coming up, the teacher who tried to fail, fail his entire class, is here to tell us why he took such a drastic action. And we head live to Chicago as the Windy City gets ready for a big weekend as the NFL draft kicks off tomorrow. How the city is celebrating, you're going to want to see that. Feeling good about Pfizer, Johnson & Johnson, or Amgen? They're all components of XLV, the healthcare sector spider ETF, which includes over 50 healthcare and biotech stocks in the S&P 500 to help add diversification and minimize single stock risk. Why invest in a single healthcare stock when you can own the entire healthcare sector of the